As many of you know, Record Store Day was this past month in April, and I really wanted to get my hands on Jethro Tull's special release for Record Store Day, which was a 1970 live recording of their Carnegie Hall concert. Now, I arrived at the record store 15 minutes, only 15 minutes after it had opened, and it was still too late. I didn't get a chance to purchase that 1970 Carnegie Hall record, but it didn't stop me. It didn't stop me from listening to Jethro Tull songs from the time. So queued up next here on this segment is the song Nothing Is Easy from a live concert that they did in 1970. And it's, uh, it's, pretty, it's a pretty good recording and Ian Anderson is as crazy as ever in this one. So enjoy his, his performance and the rest of the bands as well. And then after that, uh, I have a Grateful Dead song, or a few songs, and every spring I always get into the Grateful Dead album, Blues for Allah. I started to get into Grateful Dead during spring when I was in college, and one of my communications professors, Professor Newman, had recommended Blues for Allah and said that it was the best Grateful Dead album that there ever was. And so I, I bought it because I was just getting into them and sure enough it is one of the best. I love it. I love the production of it. I love the song choices. Um, it's, it's just a great album. So after Jethro Tull I have the first three songs queued up from Blues for Allah that's played at a live concert in 1976. Um, first up is Help Is On The Way, then Slipknot, then Franklin's Tower. So first up on this segment we have Jethro Tull, Nothing Is Easy, and then we have Grateful Dead. So please enjoy. <laughs> 